96.1 at the Eagle. It's another edition of Central New York Bands That Rock. In the studio with us today is Ryan Quinn. How are you, Ryan? I'm great. Thank you for having me, Cindy. Thanks for uh, stopping in. By the way, Central New York Bands That Rock, powered by Big Apple Music. They are <laughs> great supporters of local music here. They so really are. They really are. So, what's been going on with you? You don't even live in Central New York anymore. You moved away, so get us up to date. Well, it's really nice to be back in the area. It still feels like it's home to me. It probably always will. But uh, I'm in L.A. now, as a lot of people know, I guess. Um, and I don't have a real person job. I'm pursuing music full time, whether it's corporate events, college shows, studio work, playing for four hours at a five-star resort in Laguna Beach. Mm -hmm. Whatever I'm doing, is it's involving music. Um, and currently, I'm, I'm back here doing a college tour thanks to uh, APCA and Tim Moyer of Gridley Page and GP Entertainment. That's right. Yeah. So how is that going? Do you like interacting with the students? Absolutely. And, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And every show really is completely different. Um, the amount of people, the, the involvement, where the show takes place, whether it's in a big venue or like in the lunchroom or if it's outside for like a, a block party or something. But everyone's always really appreciative and I always I always make new connections everywhere I go. Right. Now I know that Tim had approached you um, after The Voice. Yeah. Okay, and you had auditioned for this um, a while ago. But how are you getting your other gigs? Do you have an agent or no. you're doing it all on your own? People are coming to you? Well, yes, yeah. Actually, <laughs> um, it's a lot of like friend of a friend kind of a thing in LA. Um, and there are a couple really nice venues and well, there's a bunch of really nice venues to play in Los Angeles, but my favorite one so far is called the Hotel Cafe. Like Adele had a live album recorded there. Wow. John Mayer just played a secret show at this place, but it's also really like approachable and people uh, that are just normal people like me can go and play there too. Um, and so me and a couple of my, my voice friends would go and sign up for the whole night and we'd, you know, book like a couple months in advance and like make a night of it, uh -huh. that kind of a thing. Right. Yeah. So, uh, tell us about some of the other musicians that you've been playing with. Sure. Um, well, you, you know, Frank Briggs is, I know yes. you know him quite well. Yes, I know Frank. Uh, Frank was a drummer of 805 and Frank has kind of become my... LA dad you know he's mm -hmm. he's uh, really taking me under his wing and provided me a lot of support and giving me mentorship and uh, it just he has my back and it's really appreciated you know especially in a town as superficial as Los Angeles do you feel that yeah yeah how do yeah. you feel that um I just I don't know I don't really know how to explain it you just kind of you talk to people and everybody sort of has a uh Everybody's in the entertainment industry, first of all. Most people, whether it's acting or music, um, modeling, whatever, modeling, yeah. anything. Mm -hmm. you know? And uh, there are great people in Los Angeles mm -hmm. that I've met and I've surrounded by. But of course, like with any place, there are people that are not great. Not, <laughs> that, like, uh, you can tell they're not genuine. They're yes, not genuinely very, nice yeah. and things and I, like that. Yeah, I, f I find it easy to read through that kind of stuff, to see through it. Um, Lucky for you. I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so far, so good, I guess, of maintaining a good mm -hmm. core group of people. That's great. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about the song you're going to play for us now. It's a song I wrote called uh, What Comes Next, and it's, uh, well, it's about being in a new place and uh, meeting people that, like we spoke of earlier, that are, you know, you can kind of see through their facade and you kind of avoid them. And on the other side, being grateful for the people that you have in your life that aren't like that. It's a lovely day we're having Oh, it's fine, you don't have to lie I'd rather you don't wait 
waste my time A smile without motives That would be nice Don't try to defy my senses Is it that hard to be real anymore? I must see things through different lenses And I find I'm scared to death of what comes next I'm still new to this town Haven't gotten around much But all that I know is I'm thankful for you tonight I'm down on myself, hey, what else is new? I'm probably going nowhere Oh, it's okay Truth. I need to embrace my doubt here And I find I'm scared to death of what comes next to it What if it's more than I'm ready for But all that I know is thanks to you I'll be fine I'll be fine Still new to this town, haven't gotten around much But all that I know is I'm thankful for you tonight Scared to death of what comes next to it What if it's more than I'm ready for But all Fine. I'll be fine